Hello my friends and channel subscribers, Greg here from Brisbane, Australia with another uncut, unedited, no bull video. Today's video about Bissell Stem Eraser Pro and why you need one if you're already good full uh, uh, carpet cleaner like uh, Bissell Evolution um, Pro Heat 2 X. So maybe you've got little animals like this one or maybe you've got big human animals it doesn't matter what it is but you may have carpet huge like that and you may not have time or ability to clean the whole thing maybe you need to raise one stain only so maybe that's the reason why you need stain eraser and let me release this dog and I'll walk you through what is the difference between the two and why you may buy one in addition to one you already have if you have one all right, let's release the dog and I'll be with you in a second. So, you may ask yourself, I've got one of those and I'm cleaning carpets, why do I need stain eraser? First of all, look at the size of this carpet. And if you clean this carpet in bits and pieces, it might be different color. So it's the first reason why you may would like to clean the spot only. The second one is to clean this size of the carpet it may take you more than an hour and also you will use a lot of solution solution when I talk about solution you need to use uh, provided by Bissell um, concentrate where you uh, dilute it with water and you put on a, on a top tank and everything that I'm talking about today will be in the video description all those devices and solutions will be listed there so if you like me shopping at amazon uh, it will be free uh, feel free to uh, click on it and check it out but you don't have to and i'm not endorsing the strategy i just released a recently video how you can make your own chemicals uh, carpet cleaning so today's video is not about chemicals today is about cleaning i cannot imagine cleaning this size of the carpet uh, more than once a month so it's a lot of effort, it's a lot of time. And by the way, when you clean area like that, you cannot walk on it for a day. So if it's your main area, you may think twice before you clean, you may time it more carefully. And this appliance may be not for you. If you're interested in what this appliance is, that's a Bissell uh, Power Heat Pro 2X. And um, I created video with unboxing, which I put uh, above and also created a couple of videos with carpet cleaning and my thoughts. I will subsequently, the card will pop up on top. So check on those if you didn't check that video yet. So, is this appliance great? Yes, it is, it's my opinion. Does it do everything? No, it doesn't. Uh, and my first uh, not so good feedback to them is it's not a complete appliance. So for example, they provided with uh, what they call a pet cleaner attachment. I'll bring it a little bit closer. And you can see what's the beauty of it. It has compartment where it's supposed to separate all the hairs. It has a, a scrub and has a vacuum. What basically does, you spray solution in, you kind of rub it and you vacuum it. And the reason why this appliance is good and this attachment is not, because this appliance has two huge brushes. Look at them. I'm not sure if they're visible to you. And those brushes scrub the carpet. They flick all the dirt and things out. You won't be able to scrub with a little uh, uh, appliance like that. So if you already got um, Power Heat Pro X2, you can, by all means, use spot cleaning with that attachment. But my uh, uh, point where you start in the whole big appliance, which is noisy, which you need to prep, you need to uh, clean after you finish, and you use the small attachment, which is not quite efficient. So if you're looking at the uh, Eraser Pro, there's a brush that will rotate. What it does, it works uh, not as well as the uh, uh, big appliance, but it will work much better than this scrub that you just made a little scrub. It's almost like... I know it's not useless, but it's not as effective as this one. So this one is designed, if you've got tough stain, whether it's uh, kids being naughty or big night out or pets, so you can clean that stain with the chemicals, you disinfect it, you clean it and everything like that. I 
I found it's really hard to clean it with the big appliance. And the second one is you don't have to get the big appliance out. You've got a cordless appliance like that, which basically compact, it's cheap enough to buy, it's uh, great enough to maintain. About maintenance, I'll probably create another video of my first impressions using this one. As you can see, still all the tags attached. So unfortunately, I was too excited. I did unbox it without creating unboxing video. Forgive me about that. But uh, I guess like when you buy an appliance like this, um, you'll find uh, normal packaging with uh, example, uh, simple formulas, uh, power supply because it's uh, cordless and uh, instructions. So it's not much was on, on a packaging but of course people like unboxing sorry about that i did not create unboxing but i may uh, do a, a test run and i'll let you know how it works this one works really well but again if you've got tiny stain you don't want to uh, load all the chemicals in for little stain because uh, unfortunately as good as it is if you store it and it's still full of water uh, it may leak and uh, I think it's like messy. The second bit is the whole setup of cabling. Look, you need to connect all of that into bottom bit uh, to just start working with this. And I think in my books, it's a bit of hassle and waste of energy and waste of time. So let's talk about prices. This one, depending on where you buy from, what model it is, you may get between 500 to I guess 800 dollars. Uh, this one you can get between 170 to 300 dollars, depends where you're buying from and what model it is. Because Bissell do, um, I'm not sure whether it's Doji or not, but they just change a couple of attachments and suddenly it's become different model. Um, I disagree with the approach because the core of the appliance stays the same and functionality stays the same. It's just a couple of different attachments. And I think it has to do with the uh, latest trend of price beating. So, for example, uh, Bunnings in Australia would say if you find cheaper uh, appliance, same appliance will beat it by 10%. Well, guess what? If appliance is the same, but it's a different model, you cannot ask them to beat it by, by 10%. So by adding or uh, subtracting one appliance, it suddenly changed the model number. Again, my videos are no BS, and, and that's why I say it's uh, something that I don't like and I don't endorse. But again, it's not about uh, dodgy practices, it's about cleaning. So, uh, would I recommend this one? Yes, I already created video, it's a great one, but I'm still a little bit in two minds. Um, I expected hard floor attachments uh, to be part of this, so you cannot clean hard floors until you, until you buy a separate attachment. And also, I um, anticipated a little bit better management for pets, because most of the people that buy uh, Revolution Pro Heat um, 2X4, uh, they have pets. Uh, so that appliance wouldn't cut with what they're giving you. Yes, it's better than nothing, but it's not something that I would purposely buy to erase the stain. It's just too much hassle. This one doesn't cost much, and I think it's fit for purpose. What's the downside of this? The battery is good for probably only 15 minutes. It's beautiful for uh, stains, but if you go, for example, stairs to clean, and you don't want to uh, clean one particular spot, you would like to um, uh, clean the whole fly of stairs, it won't last long. And unfortunately, charging time is between four to five hours. So um, just reminding people it's cheap, it's nice, it's purposeful. However, it's not designed for cleaning purposes. It's designed for specifically spot cleaning, hence the name uh, as a spot cleaner. So uh, I'm excited about this one. I will try it soon and I publish video. So if you're not subscribed to my channel, it's a great time to subscribe. Please like this video if you like and please comment if you would like me to test anything else to do with those appliances. For now, I will try this one and I think I keep both because they're not really intersecting in their purpose, even though it could be one appliance that does it all. Alright, enough for today. Thank you for watching. Greg from Brisbane, Australia. Until next time.